An emotional night in Stillwater as Cowboy fans remember the 10. On the eve of the 10th anniversary of the tragic plane crash, OSU honored them like never before. Chad McKee shows us tonight's Oklahoma moment inside historic Gallagher Iba Arena. Throughout the day, they came to pay their respects, many with the same thought. It's hard to believe it's been 10 years. 10 years, 10 lives lost but 10 who will most certainly never be forgotten. It's daily that I think about it, and uh, I was on a plane ride up here, and I was just thinking about it like, man, I can't believe it's 10 years. It's a day in which there will be some sadness, but there will also be a lot of hugs and a lot of great memories, not just about those guys, but the, the great times we spent here in Stillwater. Tragedy transcends rivalry. Prior to the game, Texas coaches honored the victims by placing flowers at the memorial site at Gallagher Iba Arena. Texas players donned Remember the Ten t shirts, which were also handed out to each fan in attendance. And at halftime, with family members and friends of those ten men lost looking on, the number ten was retired by the Cowboy basketball program. When you say we will, we will remember, we will not forget to have concrete evidence that you really are committed to that. When we come to basketball games, there's people gathered around this memorial. So I hope 50 years from now, people still are gathered here. You never, I don't think I ever get thrown totally. I, I think it's something that will affect them, affect my life for the rest of my life. Uh, just because, I mean, it was just something that was just very tragic. And you know, not, not many people say they can say that they experienced something like that. This isn't a Disney story where there's some happy ending at the end. There isn't. On the other hand, I think you start to understand the impact that they had on people's lives, albeit cut far too short by the turnout and by the memories that they've instilled in us and, and how we're going to try and carry on that legacy. Oklahoma State doesn't forget. Chad McKee, OKBlitz.com. And, of course, we have very fond memories of our colleague, former sports director Bill Teagans. And his legacy definitely lives on. Tomorrow at 10, Bill's wife Janice tells us what made him so unforgettable as we honor all the 10 men. Be sure to visit our living memorial pages, Remembering the Ten, at News9.com and OKBlitz.com.